for the mark and done quite top lane one. Going to be having a word with Paul Henderson, the lead-off man for Australia, but still no marker up. Again, the marks were now talking to the Jamaican number one Beckford, but no marker. Nobody penalised. Brazil going one, Sweden in two, Italy three, Canada four, Australia five, Jamaica six, Ukraine seven, Japan in lane eight. The four by 100 metres men's relay final. Third time they get away. Australia going well, Canada going well as well, but Australia with a brilliant first leg. Henderson has run really well. On the outside, Japan, a good one too. And the Australians a good change, Henderson to Jackson. And Canada closing it up. Very, very good second led by Canada by Gilbert. And Gilbert on to Surin. Canada, Japan, Australia. And it's Canada with Donovan Bailey still to come. The gold medal saw a bad change. And Australia right there with Jamie and March. And Japan in third place. Nate Lee coming through. But Canada win this easily. Australia in second place. Italy third. Jamaica four. And Japan faded to fifth place. The time 38-3-0. Not as fast as they ran in the semi-final. But the last change was pretty appalling. At least it was safe. And they got the race fairly well sewn up by that stage. Well, you could just see out there, the Australians have had weeks and weeks of practice. Their changeovers were very good. The Canadians, they just had the two fastest men out there, and that just proved it on the third and the fourth leg. But here we can see the Australians in lane five having a good first leg and very good changeover there. So really reaching out, getting that back as quick as possible. And they were both into this back straight. The Canadian here not really gaining much ground on the Australian, but this is where we see the difference. The Canadian, Surin here, running a very good bend, keeping tight to that line without putting his foot on there, and running smoothly. This is a bad changeover. Keeps his head forward and then turns it at the last minute. Safe, but not good. But when you've got someone like Bailey on the last leg, Marsh having trouble to get past him. While well, the Canadians throughout once the Americans had disappeared, have been dominant. And even the Americans would have had trouble with them. Check on the result. Canada take the gold medal, 38.31. Australia in second place. Commonwealth first and second, 38.50. And Italy in third place, 39.07. And it's a fact, actually, Jamaica in fourth place, Commonwealth. Um, three Commonwealth teams in the first four. And in the final of the men's sprint, seven of the eight finalists were from the Commonwealth. Only Mike Marsh, America, from outside the Commonwealth. 